taking and making good shots. What a terrific job. Friends finds Towns. Edwards looking it over. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Edwards got six in the quarter. And boy, has he picked it up since the start of the second. His shots now starting to fall. Here is Doc. Edwards defending. Here's Doc. And again, Los Angeles with the triple. I'll tell you, this lead's not going anywhere with this guy making plays. What a quarter. Edwards passes to Noel. Prince with it. Inside. Schroeder with the ball. Now guarded by Town. Here's Doc. Buries it down low. Doc's got the lead up to eight now for the Lakers. I am simply blown away by his accuracy. He has made every shot, and what's most important, his team is winning. Here's Noel. He's guarded by Schroeder. Noel passes to Towns. With four seconds on the clock, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Well, beautifully done by Towns, using the up fake to bait the defender. This is his first chance at the line tonight, and Towns drops them both. And among NBA bigs, he is known for his ability to deliver at the free throw line. And so it's Los Angeles. With the score, your hands over to the wall. 41, the Lakers, 47. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Doc has been sensational. He had a fast pass to the lane that first half. Got inside on demand. Now this guy is such a good finisher on you. Let him so far, the defense has not been able to counter it. Taking a look at Los Angeles. We've got Russell Westbrook. Thomas Bryan is out there with Anthony Davis. And there's all the way up there, And it's hard. LeBron and at the three, the small forward. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Thanks very much. The Lakers are, of course, one of the league's storied franchises. And Magic Johnson was asked recently if they have the best all-time collection of players. He says it's not even close. Outside of Bill, we have all the dominant closers. Kobe, Jerry, LeBron now, Worthy. Come on now, it's just too many Lakers. Kevin, back to you. <laughs> He's got a point, David, and we thank you for your report. And in the last decade, defenses switching on screens has increased dramatically. Is this the new normal? Yeah, Kevin, I think so. Yeah, I think teams that switch well tend to defend well. Because switching can create mismatches, but it's harder to punish those now with all the help defense. Left side, Edwards. Another miss by Minnesota. Only 20% shooting in this quarter. They need to settle down and relax a little bit here. Here's Doc. Trying to get open is Davis. Doc can't get it to go. Timberwolves trail by seven. Pass to Edwards. Good, and the assist goes to Russell. Russell's got his third assist on the night. Uh, taking the contact in the NBA, such a critical skill. Anthony Edwards, the frame and the game. From deep three-point range, and again, no good by the Lakers. And when you are as good a shooter as he is, you have to have the confidence to take that shot. It might not always fall. And for most guys, I think you only want to take that shot if you've hit a few in a row. That is absolutely a heat check. To the wing right side. Here's Todd. A three-pointer. Pick it up. You're one for four, and you certainly don't want to give your opponent momentum. Edwards kicks to Russell. A pass to Gobert. Back to Russell. Four on the shot clock. Pulls from the top of the key. The shot, no good. And it's the Lakers the other way. Hard to believe Greg last season.
season, LeBron missing the playoffs for just the third time in his career. It almost felt surreal to not have him in the playoffs. I mean, this guy's been a fixture in the postseason for almost two decades now. Just another bullet on LeBron's incredible resume. And the Timberwolves call time. And then last year, Minnesota had a tough to dot. From downtown, good on the three-point shot. Dodge got 27. I don't think the Timberwolves great plan on letting their playoff statistics discourage them at all. And that's kind of the beauty of this squad. They're out to make new franchises. Not focusing on the past. Just keep evolving as a team. And now, let's take a look at the new balance player of the game, Anthony Davis. And as you'd expect, he's done most of his damage in that low block. I mean, that was the game plan to get it to him in the paint and just let him go to work. The hip boy has the big fella delivered. He has just killed them down low. With the short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Hey guys, I listened in on what Chris Finch was talking about with his players. He is upset about the perimeter play. He told the guys on the defensive end, stay connected to the shooters. On the offensive end, they don't have an open shot, pass it around. Let's see if the ball starts to unstick, Kevin. Thank you, David. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. Number one pitch are at the forwards, Edwards in town. Then it's Russell, and it's Rudy Gobert, and it's Noel in at the two guard. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. Here's Todd, and another three for the Lakers. And this is the game plan for him. He's a big part of their floor space. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team, productive and efficient. Here's Towns the mark from 16 feet out. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. On loads, and the Lakers the take out two more. And, and we'll just watch the clock wind down, guys, in what will turn out to be a win here for the Lakers. They made more foul shots, and that was the difference. That, that was a big advantage. The other team was defending with their hands instead of moving their feet, and they handed them a lot of easy points at the line. And whoever went important in this one will go down as win number three. And once it becomes official, this win gives them a nice confidence boost against this team. They'll face them twice more this season. And one of the key components to this victory, if not the biggest, was the incredible performance for Doc. Efficient productivity. You love what this guy has given to you on the offensive end. Seven second difference, shot and game clock, and Doc gets it to go saw the opportunity to put this away and did not turn it down. Yeah, playing with great energy and great effort. And as a coach, you'd love to see this from your team every single night. This is what they needed earlier on. At some point, it's too little, too late. Yeah, but then again, this run came against a team that may have felt it had already won, and you get the sense it let its guard down. Spirited performance. You love to get this kind of win, especially on the road. You've got to be able to block out all distractions in enemy territory. This team did a tremendous job staying focused on the task at hand. And it's Russell missing. From deep, it drops. So it's Los Angeles winning this one easy. The they came in here and took care of business like they were the home.